The Evermore album. I'm excited. Thank you all for voting, by the way, on my Patreon for this. All right, Evermore. Life was a willow and it bent right to your wind. They count me out time and time again. Fucking wrong though. Life was a willow and it bent right to your wind. God, it's just mystical. Love it. I come back stronger than a 90s trend. Oh shit, pay problems. What the fuck? Bring it in, bring it in. Telling a story. Taylor. I don't have champagne, I got wine. It's close. Because I dropped your hand while dancing, left you out there standing, crestfallen on the land in champagne problems. So this is going from the point of view, or at least being written, we assume, by the point of view of her, as if she left somebody else. God, you never know with Taylor. Damn it. He told your family for a reason. Oh, that family was. He told your family. Family was slightly fluttered there. Your sister splashed out on the bottle. Now no one's celebrating. I like that slide on celebrating. Celebrating. Don Perry on you brought it. No crowd of friends applauded. Your hometown skeptics called it champagne problem. <sighs> Fuck everybody else. You're speechless. Love slipped beyond your reaches. And I couldn't give a oh. reason. Champagne problem. That's like the worst when you break up with someone and you, you're just not even, you don't even know it. And you don't have a reason. It's like they need a reason. They need some kind of understanding. Oh, I love when she does the instrumentals in the middle of her songs. This is something that's missing in pop music. You might as touch on the Chevy door, November flush and your flannel cure. This dorm was once a madhouse. I made a joke, well it's made for me how. Okay, I'm lost on that whole section. One for the money, mm. two for the show. I never was ready so I watch you go. Sometimes you just don't know the answer to someone's on their knees and asks you. Oh shit. Oh, sometimes you don't know the answer until someone's on their knees and asks you. They ask you to marry them and you say no. Fuck. Who, was this with someone? Was this with her ex? What a shame she's fucked in the head, they said. Oh, damn. Hold your hand while dancing. Never leave you standing. Crestfallen on the landing with champagne problems. Wow. Your mom's ringing your pocket. You'll find somebody else. Picture in your wallet. That you'll love. You won't remember all my champagne problems. Well, that's not gonna work. You won't remember all my champagne problems. Like you'll move on. That was magical. I don't know of any other song that's written from this perspective. Damn. All right, Gold Rush. I don't like a gold rush. Oh. Gold rush. Oh, I like a beat coming in. I don't like slow motion, double vision in rose blush. I don't like the falling pills that fly into the bone. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I know some of you guys get mad at me that I stop things. I am missing shit. I'm with you for the long haul, okay? I don't like that falling feels like flying till the bone crush. See, that's some deep shit right there, people. That takes a moment. This is like a bad relationship. This is a bad thing and she knows it and she doesn't like that she's doing it, but she's doing it anyways. I don't like a gold rush. She's popular like a gold rush. What it must be like to grow up that beautiful. She's lusting after somebody that's popular, that's like the man of the year or that all the other women are going after and she's doing the same thing and she doesn't like that she's doing the same thing. She doesn't like that it feels like it's okay even though she knows it's not okay. To call you out on your contrarian shit. Wait. Contrarian shit was contrarian. A person who takes an opposing view, especially one who rejects the majority opinion as in economic matters. At dinner parties, I call you out on your contrarian shit. So she maybe is like, you're acting like you don't agree with this, but you actually do. Come on, cut the bullshit. What must it be like to grow up that beautiful? I love her quiver on what must it be like? My mind turns to your life. Folklore. Ah, my mind went to life in the folklore. This 
bitch. Putting in Easter eggs already for the next album. Cause it fades into the gray of my day. Gray of my day. There's that sliding feeling with the vocals again. So fighting, I almost jump in. I love the harmonies on that too. Tis the damn season. Is it some Christmas shit? If I wanted to know who you were hanging with while well, I was gone, I would have asked you. It's the kind of cold fogs up windshield glass, but I felt it when I passed you. This album so far is the only album that I've reacted to of hers that I feel like each song, almost have to listen to it two or three times to get it. And then once you get it, then you're fucking attached. There's an ache in you, put there by the ache in me. Fuck. That's a line. So she's pulling away from him and he's feeling it. Is that what's going on? We could call it even. You could call me babe for the weekend. Tis the damn season right this time. And it's so gentle, so we could call it even. I parked my car right between the Methodist and the school that used to be ours. I love the da da da. We're, we're getting more sloping tones. She's sliding into it, but without I part my car, there's not any of this. I part my car. It's much cleaner. The Childhood holidays, friends, love her. like bad perfume. Run, but only so far. Bad perfume. God. It's okay with me. We could call it even. Oh, I just call love that high on the top of the hat. It's the damn season. Ride this down. Ride this down. That's beautiful. Time flies. I see as the mud on your truck ties. Now I'm missing your smile. Hear me out. We could just ride around. And the road not taking looks real good now. Maybe she left him at a like family event like she was kind of saying and he watched her leave and then now time goes by things are messy and now i'm missing your smile hear me out we could just ride around in the road not taking looks real good now that's a different that's a change in the story half the day, god i haven't done that forever if you don't ask me to stay. Somebody needs to fucking speak out and nobody is. So they're just kind of like, I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not gonna say anything. Okay, fine, whatever. And just moving on. I'll go back to LA. No. And my so-called friends who write books about me if I ever make it. Shit. Wonder about the only soul who can tell which smiles I'm faking. And the heart I know I'm breaking is my own. Self-sabotage, honey. To leave the warmest bed I've ever known. God, but why are you doing this? It's like self-perpetuating destruction. One person wants something, the other person actually wants the same thing, but they're both too afraid to say anything. So they just keep moving on until it's too late. an interesting subject matter but it's it, i think it rings true for so many people though right tolerate it oh tall mm -mm. i remember this song no i need you right now oh my god i just relate to this song in a past relationship so hard fuck okay here we go god the presentation of this song too during Era's tour. Ugh. Maybe this is a song that I was thinking of and not All Too Well. Maybe I keep referencing to All Too Well. This is the one where she's on the table. Motherfucker, this song. You're so much older and wiser and I, I wait by the door like I'm just a kid. Use my best colors for your portrait. Lay the table with the fancy shit. Watch you tolerate it If it's all in my head Tell me now Tell me I've got it wrong somehow I know my love should be 
Just, just the way that she was able, she's able to put this into words. I know my love should be celebrated, but you tolerate it. God, I feel this is, I guess I, this song is so triggering to me. I feel it just in so many levels of like, it's that feeling of, of wanting to be loved, you know? And you're just reaching out to the person and you're uh, like, I take your indiscretions all in good fun. She's just doing everything she can. I polish plates until they gleam and glisten. What can I do to make so this right to make you love me? And wiser and I. that she also puts like lay the table with the fancy shit because there's underlying all this desperation is still this you're angry because you're angry because you're like why the fuck do i deserve this why aren't you what the fuck is wrong with you there's like this undercurrent of anger behind this pain while you were out building other worlds where was i was that man who threw blankets over my barbed wire I made you my temple, my mirror, my sky Now I'm begging for footnotes in the story of your life Drawing hearts in the byline A line in a newspaper naming the writer of an article So she's like painting him, she's painting his portrait using her best color She's doing what she can And even so much as drawing hearts, making hearts as her name to show him more love. Is that what we're talking? Is that what that means? Always taking up too much space or time. Right? This is the, where you feel like you're shit. Pray for you, leave us in ruins. Right? Took this dagger and me and removed it. Uh. Gain the weight of you, then lose it. Believe me, I could do Right? It. She's like, do I close that door? If it's all in my head, tell me now. I'll do it. I'll fucking do it. Tell me. I sit and watch you. Oh, what a line to end it on, too. It's like you're you're sitting there and you're watching them and, and all of this. All of this is going through your head. And they're just tolerating it. No body, no crime. He did it. Scarf. Her husband's acting different and it smells like infidelity. She says that ain't my Merlot on his mouth. Oh shit. That ain't my jewelry on our joint account. Ah, oh, no. There ain't no doubt. I think I'm gonna call him out. If I find out my man is cheating, it's fucking on. But if I find out not only is he cheating, but he's buying shit for her with my money. I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> I think he did it, but I just can't. Well, he bought jewelry on your joint account and it's not yours. SD wasn't there. Tuesday night at all have gotten out of job or anywhere. He reports his missing wife. No. And I noticed when I passed this house, his truck has got some brand new tires. And his mistress moved in. Sleeps in SD's bed and everything. No, there ain't no doubt. Somebody's gotta catch him out. This is so like a fucking Carrie Underwood song. What is going on? Good thing my daddy made me get a boating license when I was 15. She's gonna fucking kill him, isn't she? I've cleaned enough houses to know how to cover up a ah, scene. Shit. This entire reaction is actually three hours long. You only get a tiny bit. So if you want to support me and if you want more Taylor Swift, then you need to come on over to my Patreon. On Patreon, we have full album reactions, sometimes as much as like five, six, seven hours long. Movies, concerts, documentaries, song reactions, extended editions, and an entire Swifty community. I will be sure to link that in the comment section down below. Good thing Esty's sister's gonna swear she was with me. She was with me, dude. She was with Good me, dude. Thing <laughs> his mistress took out a big life insurance policy. They think she did it, but they just oh, can't prove it. See, I fucking told you! This is that country song shit! <gasps> they think she did it. I love it that she's doing this, too!
can't prove it. Oh my god. She thinks I did it, but she just can't prove it. No. Nobody, no crime. Oh, he died. <laughs> I wasn't letting up until the day he died. Oh, she whispers it too. Mm-hmm. All right, happiness. Honey, when I'm above the trees, I see this for what it is. But now I'm right down in it. All the years I've given is just shit we're dividing up. Oh no! Is this telling the story about when she? I was just gonna say it has the same feel as you tolerate it. You know, it's just shit we're dividing up. So she left. And in the disbelief, I can't face reinvention. Right? I haven't met the new me yet. Yeah, this feels like it's setting all the way into that same scene, and this is the continuation of that story. I haven't met the new me yet. Oh my gosh. Your winning smile begin to look like a smirk. When did all our and start to look like weapons pointed at my deepest. When did all our lessons start to look like weapons? I feel like so far in this album, there's a lot of lines that are just, I don't know if I'm gonna quite get it. L lessons, like things that we learned, things that we went through. It's like, okay, learning that, that I can be loved, right? That could be something. It looks like weapons at my deepest hurt because at that point, then you're leaving that person and you're not together anymore. And so that feels even more painful. I hope she'll be a beautiful fool. Who takes my spot jet. next to you? No, I didn't mean that. Sorry, I can't see facts through all of my feelings. Ah. God, there's so many emotions going on, and she's just laying it out for us. In our history, That's across a great there. divide. I love it. Uh love when she's doing these pulsings on this album. Dappled with the flickers of light from the dress I wore at midnight. Leave it all behind. All the memories. And there's happiness. That's some low shit right there. There's happiness. I can't make it go away by making you a villain. That's a different note choice of Taylor Swift. I can't make it go away. That's a big jump. She doesn't normally do it like that. And I pulled your body together seven years. Mine every goddamn night. Now I get fake niceties. Oh. No one teaches you what to do. A good man hurts you, and you know you hurt him too. Oh. she when she finally can see everything when she steps away from it which is kind of a future self what it will happen and then she'll be able to look back on it and see the happiness that was inside of it but when you're in it all you can see what's in front of your face which is anger and sadness and pain and it's difficult all you want from me now is the green light of forgiveness you haven't met the new me yet. Yeah, you can't ask that soon and i think she'll give you that Beautiful way to think of it too. Wow. I feel like these songs are like, we're diving into her journal. This is her life. And I feel like she almost went into the studio and just was like vomiting all of this pain and everything she's going through and putting it all out there. This is what she needed. I feel that so strong with this. Dorothea? Hey Dorothea, do you ever stop and think Dorothea. about Dorothea! <laughs> Shit. When, when we were younger, younger What is that from too? Park, honey, making a lark of misery. When we were younger. What is that from? That's from another song. You're a queen selling dreams, selling makeup and magazines. not from 
Taylor Swift's perspective? Is this like a guy who loves a chick named Dorothea? And he's like saying like, whenever you want to come back home, I'll be here. Is that what this is? Come back to my side. The stars in your eyes shine brighter and too below. And if you're yeah, at the top, like, be known. Or she's in love with Dorothea. You always know me. Or she just wanted to write a song about the name Dorothea? I don't know. I think in the album so far, you know me, there are certain songs that I don't really care about and I feel like, eh, maybe because I don't get it. Maybe it's part of a trilogy that I didn't know about. I know you guys and your fucking trilogies and all that shit. All right, Coney Island, are we gonna feel the same thing? Am I gonna like you? Never been to Coney Island. Featuring the National. I keep seeing all these featured. I don't really hear anybody else. Break my soul in two. Looking for you, but you're right here. Looking for you, but you're right here. Oh, if I can't right. relate to you any more than who am I related to. Ooh, is this about her relationship again? And I'm sitting on a bench in Coney Island wondering where did my baby go? Yeah. The fast times, the bright lights, the merry go. Sorry for not making you my centerfold. That's the idea of where she's blaming herself. She didn't give him enough attention during everything. She, I mean, fuck, Taylor Swift has to deal with her fame, with her fans, with her music, with being a woman, with being popular, with the business side of all of it, and then giving her own self some time to fucking breathe on top of balancing a relationship, keeping it special, keeping him important, making him her centerfold. When the sun goes down. I like that delay there too. Feels like you're waiting. And then we have the instrumental. The pounds my head. What the What's fuck? A lifetime of achievement. I didn't expect it, dude. But you were too polite to leave me. Hmm. Ooh. Do you miss the rogue who coaxed you into paradise and left you there? His voice is a trap. Will you forgive my soul when you're too wise to trust me and too old to care? You're too wise to trust me and too old to care. Was he a lot older than her? I feel like she keeps referencing to how old he is, but in the very few pictures that I have seen of her ex-boyfriend, he didn't seem that much older. Was he a lot older? And this dude's voice did not expect it. I don't know if I'm liking it. I wanna like his voice, but I don't like his voice with her voice. He needed to soften up a little or she needed to harden up a little. When the sun goes down That's low as shit for him too. Were you waiting at a old spot in the tree line by the gold clock? Did I leave you hanging every single day? Is that him doing the harmony? The upper harmony there? Because that sounded great. Were you waiting at a old spot in the tree line by the gold clock? Did I leave you hanging every single day? Were you standing? In the hallway with a big cake, happy birthday. Did I paint your bluest skies the darkest gray? The universe way. It, yeah, it's it's too forward. It's not whispery enough or airy enough. It feels not flowing enough too. Over and over. Ooh, the highs up there are beautiful. Lost again with no surprises, disappointments. Close your eyes and it gets colder and colder.
touch brought forth an incandescent glow. Uh, see, we have poetry in these words. Oh, God damn, my pain fits in the palm of your freezing hand. Oh, I love it. Taking mine, but it's been promised to another. Oh, I can't stop you putting roots in my dream lane. My house of stone, your ivy grows. Love this. This is a this is about her saying like no 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 I can't be attracted to you. No, you can't come in. She's built a house of stone. Your ivy grows, and now I'm covered in you. I told you I would like this song. Stop you putting roots in my dream land. Yeah, right there. Put my roots house in my dream of stone. Land. Your ivy grows, and now I'm covered. Clover blooms in the fields. Spring breaks loose. The time is near. She is cheating. Coast is clear, spring breaks loose, but so does fear. He's gonna burn this house to the ground. This is beautiful, and yet you could see them like running through the forest with the mist sneaking off, right? This is some witchy shit, right? This is what this this is what this head wrap was for. This style of song. So yeah, it's a fire. Goddamn blaze in the dark. Shakes, who's gonna burn the house down, right? If he found out. So yeah, it's a war. It's the goddamn fight of my life, and you started. Yeah. You started it. Damn. Oh, there's Jack Antonoff. Isn't he the one that also helped with her 1989 album? Is that who that was? I loved that song, Ivy. That was so fucking poetic. That was mystical and amazing in the way that she used words on Ivy and like, like into my dreamland and, and burn this house down and then later on things are on fire, like the whole thing and it's mystical and magical and some witchy ass shit. Like I fucking loved that song. Yes, give me good shit, Taylor. Cowboy like me. And the tennis court was covered up with some tent like thing. This is such an interesting transition because we went again from mystical, magical, we're in like the fucking garden and shit like that to now we're in like a, a men's billiard downstairs or something like the men's smoking room or some shit. I'm going to have a cognac on this one. Cowboy like me, never wanted love, just a fancy car. <laughs> That's a cowboy thing? Got another male vocalist in the background on this one. Remember how we were listening to Coney Island and I was like, yeah, it doesn't really blend? His blend. This is beautiful. He's got that soft texture. She's got a little bit of a heavier texture, but they're blending together on that chorus. I like this. We could be the way for it, and I know I'll pay for it. I don't know I'll pay for it. Damn. I feel like this is like a cognac song, anyways. So then does this mean that she's now single and she's going after somebody else? Is that what the song is about? It's like, like... And skeletons in both our claws yeah. plotted hard to fuck this Right? That's what I was just gonna say. person that you're slow dancing with, right? Marcus Mumford. Good vocals, Marcus. Good fucking blending vocals.
I like it, okay? Long story short, what's the long, what's the short version of the long story? Let's hear it. Long story short. Oh, what the fuck? I did not expect this. Faithfully, I tried to pick my battles till the battle picked me. Okay, that is some postal service shit right there. A knife cuts both ways if the shoe fits, walk in it till you high heels break. I fell from the pedestal right down ah. the rabbit hole Long story short, it was a bad time I ah. pushed from the precipice, clung to the nearest lips Long story short, it was the wrong Wait, pushed from the precipice, clung to the nearest lips Long story short, it was the wrong guy Okay, so she's off sleeping around, having a good time Going, this is not what I thought it was gonna be Actually, I always felt I must look better in the rear view They once held the keys to uh, I look better in the rear view meaning is I look better once you've already left me and then you realize what you had is that what that means no more keeping score now I just keep you on no more tug of war now I just know there's more no more keeping score feels like they're now moving I just forward keep you the to get lost in these petty things. She just sounds happier in the song. Like her vocals sound lighter and brighter and less deep, even though they're still similar notes. I'm all about you I'm all about That's you like a celebration now. song, right? I'm all about you yeah, celebration song. It was a bad time. Long story short, I said. What a difference. Absolute difference in style. We're getting we're getting a full story with this album. Who's Marjorie? I feel like I should know who Marjorie is for some weird reason, but maybe that's like the Betty in the August. Oh no, is this a song that's about her grandma, be right? Be so kind. You forget to be clever. These are all the pictures of her grandma. Oh, fuck you, I'm gonna fucking cry again. Damn it, you guys. <laughs> I didn't know better. Mm. I'm already gonna cry. What died didn't stay dead. What died didn't stay dead. You're alive, you're alive <laughs> in my head. Never be so polite. You forget your power. Right? <laughs> Never wield such power. You forget to be polite. To me now. I love her fall off the top too. And if I didn't know better, I can't even fucking sing. Fuck it, just play the shit. The autumn chill that wakes me up. You love the amber sky so much. Long limbs and frozen swims. You'd always go past where our feet could touch. <laughs> and I complain the Look at that hair. The car ride back and up the stairs. I should have asked you questions. I should have. Asked you how to be Asked you to write it down for me Should have kept every grocery store receipt Cause every scrap of you would be taken from me Watched as you signed your name Marjorie All your closets of backlog dreams And how you left them all to me Oh, all your closets of backlog dreams and how you left them to me. I mean, think about it back in that day, like women could only do so much. You were only allowed to do so much and you had to find a way to work around it, you know? She's a wild one, I love it.
you're still around. <laughs> time of tribute i mean this was what done during covid i mean that's what i think a really a big time when a lot of people stepped back because they had the time now and they had the space to look in and feel inward and reassess and and deal with things maybe they hadn't dealt with and that is the time when you start thinking about things like these and what a beautiful what a beautiful moment all right is closure gonna help with this that is not what I expected. <laughs> I'm still in the crying moment. It's been a long time, and seeing the shape of your name still spells out pain. Mm. It wasn't right the way it all went down. Looks like you know that now. That's a trip. We have like J -j 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 this background, really intense, really anxiety feeling. And then we have the beautiful piano, gentle. And then we have her at a different rhythm as well. And we have all three of these almost clashing, yet almost working, which fits this emotion. Yes, I got your letter. Yes, I'm doing better. I know that it's over. I don't need your closure. Mm -hmm. I don't need your closure. Damn. Fine with my spite. Get it. My tears and my beers and my candles. <laughs> my beers. She's a wine drinker. I don't feel her. you smoothing me over. So did he write her a letter? Did he tell her? Like, hey, how are you? Just want to make sure things are good. I'm doing good. How are you? And she's like, I don't fucking need this shit. I've gone through it. I'm moving forward, which feels like she isn't. Like there isn't closure. She isn't over it, but it's like, I'm fucking over it. You know what I mean? I know I'm just a wrinkle in your new life. Staying friends with I am it out so nice. That's interesting. So that's a big thing with these lyric videos is that we get to see the lyrics and when you auditorily, auditorially, well, I don't know, whenever you hear the lyrics, you can't hear them say, air quote, friends. You can't hear it. You have to see it. Guilty, guilty, oh. reaching out across the sea that you put between you and me. Oh, like the space it's between. It's and it's oh so unnecessary. I feel like her lyrics and her vocal melody, if we pulled it out, I feel like it could go in a different background. I'm not a huge fan of this instrumental in the background, truthfully. All right, your album is called Evermore. So Evermore better be fucking some witchy ass shit or banging, cause that's the title of your album. Great November. Since July. I'm assuming that's when they broke Motion up. capture put me in a bad light. Mm. Motion capture put me in a bad light. Meaning as like what people are seeing doesn't look good. What do you think motion capture put me in a bad light means? I replay my footsteps on each stepping stone. Ooh. Trying to find the one where I went wrong. Okay, she sounds fucking phenomenal here. It's light, it's bright, it's airy, it's floating. She's not even like edging up on those high notes. She's right over the top. God, that sounds fantastic. I had a feeling so peculiar. Peculiar. That this pain would be for evermore. God, okay, fine. I'm okay with this being the name of the album. That makes sense. I rewind the tape, but all it does is pause on the very moment all oh, is lost. It's like her going through the memories and feeling that moment. To be double crossed. Dang. This is like her healing, which is so perfect as the, the song of the album because I feel like this whole album is about her healing. I had a feeling so peculiar. Peculiar. What a weird way to say it. Cannot think of what? The cost. What the fuck was that? that will be lost. 
I don't like it, you guys. That disjointed the whole thing. It even changed, did it speed up? What the hell just happened? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Can I think of what the cost? What the fuck? Much fucking faster. Will the weather be the frost? I don't like it. I don't like it, you guys. I don't like the tempo change. I don't feel like musically it led up to it. I feel like all of a sudden it's like, da 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 da. We're changing. Why are we changing? And then I, his vocals are just so. I don't know. I don't. All the violence of the dog days. I'm on waves of being torn. She didn't write that. That's not her writing style at all. It's just not her style. I'm not a huge fan of it. In the cracks of light, I dreamed of you. Taylor, because I love that you were there. That was beautiful. All the rest, I didn't like. It was very chaotic. And I was catching my breath. Thank you. Bring me back. Bring me back, honey. This pain wouldn't be for evermore. I love the lead into that. That little voice in the back of your head that says, don't worry. It's gonna be okay. Just get through this. Bon Iver. No, bang, don't like it. Taylor Swift, William Bowery, and Justin Vernon. The, the, the vocal section by Bon Iver, the lyrics were just totally fucking different and I, I just don't feel them the same. Not a huge fan of that section at all. I, I stayed there. Oh, get it. Collected on my I like that add in. You left me. I didn't expect that transition into that high note. That's very refreshing there. She's still 23 oh. inside her fantasy. How it was supposed to be. Oh shit. Could feel the mascara oh, run. Shit. You told me that you met someone. Oh shit. Last when the words of a sister come back in whispers that prove she was not. So a friend of hers. When it's time to go. Good. Good. Good for her on that line. Now he sits on his throne in his palace of bones, praying to his greed. Oh, dang. Well, that album was fucking amazing. We really went on a journey on this. I, I feel like each album has been so different. I will see you in the next Taylor Swift album reaction or movie or concert. I will see you all in the next Taylor Swift reaction. La la la. <laughs>